Well, I'm back for part two. Yeah. <laughs> They're still at it. It's exactly 11.09 now, a.m. I wonder how long it's going to take this time, because yesterday they finished at around 3 p.m. So we'll see <laughs> how long they take. I don't know what they're doing now. Are they painting the roof now? Painting those tiles? Yeah, they're painting it now. Now they're glossing it. Well, that's good. It shouldn't take them too long now. Unless they're going to put about 20 coats on. <laughs> they're going to be here all fucking... I didn't expect them to be here. It's Saturday, so... that That's a head spin. Um... Gee, I wonder how much it costs to, you know, do what they're doing. I reckon it'll be about ten grand. I reckon they pay you know, pay half up front and the other half when you fit when they're finished. So five grand up front, five grand, yeah, when they're finished. I don't know. I've got no idea how, how much it exactly costs. But whoever the landlord is of that property, because there's five units on that property. And we're, we've we got four units on ours, so we're a tad smaller. So if the landlady wanted to do something like that on our property, it will cost a little bit cheaper. I think they charge by per, I don't know, amount of metres or something. I've got no idea. I'm not, I'm not an expert, but... <laughs> oh, yes. Now, ooh, baby, on Wednesday, when this fat derriere goes out, well, I don't really have a fat ass, but, yeah. I'd love to go out, man. I'd love to go out and climb up that ladder. <laughs> it's like, can I have a go? <laughs> They'll be like, what? No. <laughs> I'm like, damn. Yeah, I'd like to have a go. I like doing things. You know what I love doing? I'm a very adventurous person. I like to go to places, you know? I'm a creep. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Oh, no, 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 I'm not kidding. I'm a creep. No, seriously, I like to do creepy ass shit. Like, I always wanted someone, right, a group of maybe, including me, just say four people, to stay out all night with me in a cemetery and be locked in. Like get there at around 7 p.m. and stay locked in all the way till opening time and yeah like ring up a cemetery ask for permission and give them the money or whatever it is they need and then um and just go we'll bring everything with us bring my emf meter my evp recorder um yeah in extra batteries, torches and shit like that. Even a thermos with some hot tea or coffee so we can have a little break and just chill and relax at a nice, beautiful cemetery. Because, um, you know, I'm into the paranormal at heart. So I like the unknown. I've got no fear of the unknown. And I like to explore. You know, I want to do my own little ghost hunting. But... I know I really can't do that now because I can't leave my father home alone because he's bed bound and stuff and he can't walk and shit so I can't leave him home alone but maybe I can hire a nurse or whatever to come but it's going to cost a packet. We are pissed off. <laughs> if I wanted a nurse to come and take care of dad just saying I'd go out for six hours or for five hours right? Fucking guess how much it costs? About 600 bucks and that's ridiculous. So just say I want someone to come in three days a week to take care of my father for six hours while I go out and do stuff for myself, right? It's 600 bucks a pop. No fucking kidding. We found out the pricing. It's not cheap. Home care living is not fucking cheap. You get a discount, yeah, but it's not as... It's a small discount. So we can't afford that. See, but if I win the jackpot, just say, Oh, different story. We could be able to afford it, you know. Um, yeah. Like, we've got money, but we don't want to waste it on that. You know, it's for emergencies. You know what I mean? But, yeah, I'm saving money for emergencies. You know, if something happens, I've got money to cover me. And 
yeah, really that's what everybody should be doing is saving money for those rainy days and for those little emergencies that may arise. So that way you're not aggravating others for money, you know what I mean? And getting a personal loan from the bank and doing all that crap, there's no need to because if you saved your fucking money, you wouldn't need to get a personal loan. That's the whole idea. Save as much as you can every week or every fortnight, depending on when you get paid. Budget your money well, you know. And even if you only got 20 or $30 left each week or each fortnight, doesn't matter. Save it. Don't spend it. Save it. And forget about it. It will build. It will build. And, yeah. And just save your dosh, you know. Those men. <laughs> mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's 11.15. Oh, baby. And they're still at it. Well, what else? Um, we watched a movie last night. That's why I went to bed late again. Went to bed at exactly 4 a.m. Bad, I know. Went to bed at 4 a.m. and fucking that movie was good. And I've never seen it before. Yeah, it was called um, Front of the Class. It's an old movie that was done in, I think, in 2006. Yeah, 2006. Didn't see it. It wasn't too bad. It's about a guy who has a Tourette syndrome. Yeah, and he wanted to become a teacher. It's not a bad movie. Watched that off YouTube last night with Chopper. Plus we watched uh, Black Mafia Family. We watched that. And we watched Coronation Street, our normal episode. And yeah, we finished watching Heartbreak High um, the day before, like in the morning. <laughs> and I'll be bad. <laughs> um, yeah, so hopefully they'll come back with season three with that particular show on Netflix. We watched Black Mafia Family on Stan, because that's where that's showing. And then we watched a movie that was for free um, on uh, YouTube. So, yeah. Wasn't too bad. Bear with me for a second. I'm just going to get the ashtray. Come here to mama. Oh. Hang on a second, take a swig of this. It's just that cut, you know. Always have a coffee first, and then I eat something. Yeah. Oh, that noise, man, it does annoy you after a while. You try to not let it get to you. But it is getting to me. Come on. They were here yesterday making that horrible racket. And they're here again today. Uh, and all that hammering they were doing. And soaring. Metal on metal. I think they were making those bars. And putting them up. <laughs> Weird. Yeah. Well, whatever you guys got planned for this morning and for the rest of your day, may everything go well for you, everything go planned, as according to plan. And, yeah, just have a great day. You know? And I'll have a great day on my end, too, with a whole lot of noise. No point in me watching a movie. I have to turn up the TV, and I don't want to do that because I, I've got sensitive hearing because of my sonic, um, psychic hearing with my psychic ear, and yeah, I, I just can't hear TVs loud. I always have the volume in my room on number ten. No kidding, ten. <laughs> and you're thinking, what the fuck? <laughs> no, no kidding. Just like cats have sensitive hearing, I'm, I'm exactly the same. I'm a feisty feline. Meow. <laughs>